Good evening and welcome back once again. So it's our first match in Europe today, playing RB Leipzig. Now we're in the Europa League courtesy of our run in the Copa del Rey. And I think the reason we've got that is because we played Barcelona in the final and lost. But Barcelona would have a spot in the Champions League. They then can't enter the Europa League so it goes to us. I believe that's how it works. Just a couple of updates as well. The transfer window did pass. We didn't buy any more players. We weren't trying to. There were no actual outgoings in terms of transfers, but Carlson's contract did come to an end and he has left the club. Let's jump into the lineups to see who's going to start in our first match in Europe. So we have made a number of changes. Starting at the back, we've brought in Balbuena for his debut and we're giving Omaragic a rest. Brought in the old wing backs, and when I say old, I mean the youngsters, which is Teixeira and McDowell in place of the new boys, Bakker and Emerson. We've also brought in back in Herrera in midfield. Mariba's going to push slightly further up and we are going to rest Cousins, who's played really well, but he's on a bit of a downward form there. Castro is actually going to start up top, going to keep Mudrick on the left and Bajer is going to play on the right. And this is the first time La Rosa Leda has seen European competition in terms of our lifetime in this, uh, in this game. What a night this is for the fans and for the team. Like I say, we'll switch things around, around a bit in terms of resting players and, you know, we want to give everyone get some game time. By no means are we going into this thinking we can, um, you know, just roll Arby's like Leipzig over or that's going to be an easy match. Nothing like that. But you got to remember the likes of Teixeira, and McDowell, they really did well for us in the last season. They're very solid youngsters. They're going to get better over time. And Ruben Castro played immensely well in his first match for the club. Scoring a goal, could have scored more. Good tackle by Kosinu, but gives it away. I even thought about putting the, the young goalkeeper in post, but um, Schubert's on an upward form. So definitely playing him. And uh, the youngster, Balbuena, who's actually a regen, brought him in as a third choice centre back. A youngster wanted um, someone better than Kavazovic that we had, but still will not be can improve. Nice ball from Mudrik to deck share it. Get to back again. Mudrik, oh, too ambitious from that angle. I know Mudrik's very good at that sort of shot, but um, that's asking a lot there. Again, a little bit sloppy in midfield at the moment. Well, not just in midfield. Nice ball on Mudrik, though. Castro's first touch of the ball, I believe. Give it away again. Gets tackled. Good save from Schubert there. He plays a nice ball to Bajer. Potential chance for a counter maybe we get tackled they're, they're just too quick for us at the moment they're reacting so quickly to anything any ball we play that's a really bad challenge but well, that's not an injury just 
too busy looking there to see if he was injured. Castro, decent effort. Straight at the keeper, so it wasn't worried by it, but uh, he's very good at that, Castro. Like I said, I've had him in previous games. Good save from Schubert, came out quickly there. Again, giving it away though, being really sloppy. Nicely won back by Vieira. A good ball from Castro. Oh, that's not a uh, good ball to Mujic, though. What's that? Uh, I didn't think he was offside. Was it? Yeah. Yellow card from the challenge earlier. It was about 15 minutes ago now. Shower with a bit of space here. Back to Mudrick. Anyone around? Not really. And Takshara thought he got fouled there. But you don't seem to get those against the computer. And somehow Cotonou loses out. I think it's one of those games, I wouldn't say scripted, but the opposition seem to be like all of their players are on form. And even when it's not possible there, they're winning balls. It's just one of those don't know how to describe it, but you can you just sense that oh, you get that feeling, you can feel it. It feels different. Um there it is, nil nil, really tough half. We had 64% possession and a few shots on goal. I think those stats probably lie a little bit in terms of how comfortable it was, because it wasn't. No, we had a few half chances, but I would say they had Less chances, but the the better ones. And Schubert made some key saves. Good tackle from Kosinu there. Had to be very careful. I don't know how he got in the way of that. Yeah, they're just they're seeing everything they get they're intercepting everything they're getting in the way of everything. Um gonna really have to pull my finger out to, to get a goal here. Good tackle. See little things like that, it's just little touches that it's just going their way. I don't know how to get around that at the moment. That's a poor ball from Castro. He's not hit the heights of uh, his first game, but no one's played well, I would say. Mudrick. 1 0. Mudrick and Castro linking up. Finally got there in the end. It was hard work. Ooh. But Mariba started it. A couple of passes between them. Nice little one-two here. Perfectly weighted. I thought the keeper might have came out there. It was probably the wrong decision for him to stay back. Mudrick is very quick though. And a really nice finish with his left. I think we'll make some subs. So we're going to bring on Harrington and Arcas in the attack midfielder positions for Mariba and Vieira. And we're going to bring on Xerxes for Mudrick and push Ruben Castro out on the left. I can't even remember the last time Xerxes came on as a sub. Um, <laughs> so yeah, I just thought I'm going to make the subs early. Last, last game we didn't manage to make a sub because the ball just would not go out of play until about the 80 odd minute mark. So I thought I'll get them in early. We haven't played well. We've got the goal, but that's offside. I think we need to mix things up anyway, so why not do it now? Yeah, 
You know, Mudrix got his goal. He's done what I want him to do. Might be a cool kick. They got a little bit unlucky there. I can certainly see the the quality of the the wing backs when we're not playing them, which is Emerson and uh, God, what's the left back called again? Forgotten his name. Um, yeah, when we're going back to the youngsters, I can see the difference. I'm not saying that's why we've played poorly. It's not, because everyone's suffered today, I would say. Backer, that was it. Backer's the, the left back, isn't he? I think. Um, nicely into Xerxes. Oh. from Kosinu, had to be aggressive there. Nice bit from Kosinu again. I haven't given, given the ball away. It's a couple of times I think he's done that since coming on. Does well there though. Xerxes must have been offside for the rebound. Really nice play though. Castro playing it into um, Howington there, I believe it was. Yeah, I've got to be very careful because it's just one of those games where I can feel a scripted moment coming along. Um, yeah, they just everything is not going for them, but it's just. I'm sure you know what I mean. If you played the game, you can just feel like it's the game is wanting them to to play well and to win. Um, it's like someone's just suddenly put the difficulty level. And I get it, it's, it's Europe, it's the Europa League, but, you know, we've played the likes of Real Madrid and Barcelona and it didn't even feel like this. Let's see if we can hit them on the counter-attack. Nice play there. No space. That's a bad challenge. Herrera. Probably should be a yellow card. I don't know if you'll get one. Doesn't look like it. Um. I'm going to play it short. I'm not going to, like, you know play really defensive but I don't want to just launch it into the box and then get hit on the counter attack see Costner there's no way Costner on a normal game loses a ball like that that's he's so strong but there it is full time our first match in Europe and it's a success but a struggle nonetheless and like I say, looking at the stats, I mean, possession 61%, but that does not tell the story. Schubert kept us in the game a couple of times, and you'd see from his rating there, he got 6.5. Mile of match, Mudrik, he got the goal. 
that's all you can say really. I think the ratings are probably a little bit high compared to what the actual performance was. Good to see Ruben Castro getting a 7 though. And it doesn't get any easier. The next match is at home to the massive Real Madrid. Now remember we did beat them in that really good run we had in the Copa del Rey. I think it was in the quarter final we beat them. But that's it for today. Thank you very much for joining once again. Hit that like button, drop a comment down below and subscribe to the channel. But I'll see you all next time. Cheers.